How will thugs commit a crime against you? Criminals will size you up before they attack you. They want to see if you are a threat to them in any way. In doing this, they will observe you for a period of time. The period of time may be less than a minute or even maybe over a period of days. They may even take longer, such as a rapist watching a woman or a child. For example, someone on the street who is preparing for a robbery may size up someone in a matter of minutes. They're looking for someone who will be least likely to resist them. They may also believe you are also the most likely to have the funds they need. This type of person may need money for drugs and may not have the time to do long-term surveillance of you. He may go from victim to victim as quickly as he can get small amounts of money for his drugs. On the other hand, someone intending to rape a woman may take days or even weeks in the planning before the actual attack occurs. This person may want to get the woman alone without anyone able to help her. In both of these cases, how would you know if someone is planning on attacking you? You should be aware of people who are watching you. If I were a hot young woman with a lot of cleavage and I split up my skirt, maybe that's a reason for men to be watching me. If I'm a middle-aged man, then I have to ask myself, why is this person looking at me? Someone who is sizing you up may not stare directly at you. They may take many quick glances in your direction. If some stranger makes one quick glance in my direction, that's no big deal. If he continues to make quick glances at my direction, I may feel that he is thinking of attacking me. In that instance, I would want to start creating distance between myself and him as quickly as possible. If he starts following me as I am retreating and is closing the distance between us, that's a definite confirmation attack is underway. Criminals think that the worst that can happen to them is a nice policeman will come along and say sir or gentleman to them. Then if the policeman discovers that they have done something wrong, they will take them down to a comfortable jail in time for lunch or dinner. The criminal does not think that he is going to tackle some sadistic bastard who is going to kill or maim him.